such a good girl. You're such a good girl. Um, so I, so I use headbands a lot and it just brings another little bit of focus. It gives them something to think about. So most dogs are, are pretty calm, fine wearing a collar. So she can just have it on her neck for a little bit. Huh. You just want more boar. It's so good. I know it. And I like the colors because I, so my coonhound wears them a lot. And no one ever thinks anything of it. They just go, oh, she's so cute. Mm -hmm. They're bright and colorful and colors have meaning. Huh. Oh, such a good girl. Oh, that's a good girl. And she gets some tea touch. Oh, is that so good? And so these are just headbands. She can open her mouth if she wants to. And if it was really bugging her, she'd paw it off, and I'd be okay with that, but it's clearly not that big deal. So well, say again why you put them on, besides desensitizing so, them for a muzzle. Or so if we that, have a really whiny dog, or a really barky dog, or a dog that's super, super mouthy, they it's often habit. That whining and that barking is just mm -hmm. habit. You have the most and precious eyes. I need that. I'll just talk to about that. Oh, yeah. 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 Try the headband. That's oh, a good idea. Uh, Love that idea. Just so too good. this for. As long as you're okay with that. So now she yeah. does not so seem like to be that. too bothered by this, but have we noticed she's not making any noise? Where she yeah. was whimpering a little bit earlier. Most dogs, apparently, not you, would well, paw it off. I have one that would take it right off. And so I want her to. Mm -hmm. And so she can learn that she gets a choice. And it's not stuck on your face, and it's okay to have it off. And it's all, again, it's all about respect and giving them choices. Oh. And so, hypothetically, she fought it off. <laughs> but you didn't. And then I just put it back on. Here we go. And I notice I'm, I'm not being so uptight about how it's sitting on her face. It's just, it's bringing awareness regardless. There she tried to pick it up. Oh, did she? Did well, you see her paw come up? It, and if she so wasn't it. for that? I thought she yeah. was reaching for the tree. No, she, no, she, she did it did twice she? now. Yeah. But, even, but see, but she but knows point, she can. Yeah. Exactly. So it's not about, oh, no, don't, don't take it off. If you want to take it off, great. Yeah. Hey, okay, those are mine. <laughs> <laughs> no more. It's but, not impeding her actions at all. No, it's not. And see, she just licked her lip. What's that? She says, I want some more. Be a good thing or not for a dog that's barking because of separation anxiety. I wouldn't put it on a dog and then leave them by any means. No, but it just brings awareness. So, it does. so what about a dog who has bitten people or other dogs? I, I'm always talking to people about bringing awareness to the mouth mm -hmm. and doing those kinds of exercises. Wouldn't this be a good thing for that? Yeah, just and using it the same way to bring awareness to... <laughs> So I like the headbands because they're easy and they're, for for my clients, I just want to make everything easy. So, yeah, we're going to take this off of you because that's enough. It doesn't need to be this whole long drawn out thing. Just like with the body wraps we were talking about, moments, not minutes, with the touches, everything. Mm -hmm. So that can, she can have a little break. And I'm going to take a headband off. Yeah, there we go. And I'm going to show you something else for that. 